hi guys how are you doing today um if you're new to this channel my name is joseph i am a microsoft certified trainer i hope you've been enjoying all the videos that we've been doing so today we are going to be focusing on uh, troubleshooting issues with microsoft teams okay uh, because some guys have reached out and um, we've discussed about issues regarding troubleshooting uh, teams and uh, generally m365 but there was a particular request by one of the candidates preparing for an interview that was prompting me to run this class with you today. So uh, I want to bring up a very popular URL um, put together by Microsoft and this is it opening in a bit. So uh, Microsoft Teams troubleshooting. So uh, generally there are issues around this library actually of article will provide guidance to troubleshooting and fixing errors uh, that you may experience while using Microsoft Teams. So for um, issues that have to do with signing, uh, you can have someone having issues getting stuck while trying to sign into Teams. Uh, you can also have situation where users, um, Teams does not automatically get updated and then you can also have issues that is around errors you are missing out during signing into Microsoft Teams. So these are issues regarding the sign in in Microsoft Teams. We're going to be focusing on these ones for now and then we can go into other areas uh, much later. So if you're having issues getting stuck in, in login loops, that is if you are opening the application this way, you just keep loading loading and loading instead of it to automatically open for you okay so one thing that you must know first of all is teams can store some catch in your system that you may want to clear right you may want to clear your catch first so i will not just do that um, on my own but i'm going to do the web search so that you can know how to search for the information required to also clear your teams catch now i will do clear Teams catch. Let's do it this way. I'm sure it's going to come up very soon. Yeah, look at it. How to clear Teams card for Microsoft Teams. It's saying quit uh, Teams by right clicking on it and then click on quit. So if you come here on your Windows, you will see Teams here. It is saying that we should quit Teams. That is the first instruction. And that has quitted Teams. And what's the second step? That we should select Windows icon and then set for run and then we should open run app and cut and paste the following command this one here right to this place so um this to this place we control c it and then we delete all the containing folder so we are going to do run right so we set for run from here and it's going to bring this for us so what we do when this open we should paste this one here and click OK. Now when you click OK, then it's going to give you all of these folders. Now what you do is Ctrl A everything and then you delete all. You delete it permanently. Permanently delete. Then it asks you yes, delete it. So when you do this, right, some people can be afraid, but I want to tell you that these are files that will be generated when you are reopening your Microsoft Teams again. So this does not take care, this does not delete any of the data that you currently have, your chat, your message, everything is still in place, but it's only taking away the hidden files that are no longer needed. Now you can see that this folder is empty. Let's call up Teams again. You can see that the folder will start building again because once you are opening Teams again, you can see it will be loading up those applications for you. But at this time, Teams may take a little longer time for it to open again for you, or it can ask you to try to sign into Teams because at this point, you have signed out of Teams entirely. So you can see behind this that it is loading the same application, I mean, the same folders that you have deleted before, right? So you can try to sign in again into teams and you are expected not to have issues regarding your signing admin um let me sign into my account again uh-huh no 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 it's not that um okay 
all right so i'm going to sign back in um uh, excuse me okay so let me just take this off and then try to sign into at uh, okay all right so that's loading up and then i'm going to supply so whatever is happening now is all the catch system that are in this system have been taken away so i will just put in my password um okay so when i sign in now it's going to be again something that is very new right like everything every hidden folders that could cause my teams to misbehave has been taken care of now let's look at something what are those issues uh i think we are open here right let's come back to this place now why that teams is loading over there when you have teams talk and looping without allowing you to sign in this that you have done in most of the cases would help you resolve issues regarding that there are other issues that um, um, can be resolved when you clear catch let me show you those other issues from what i have here right so i want this url to open so that i can show you issues that you can also resolve you clearing teams card now teams app not launching properly instead showing uh, a message saying we are sorry we are we ran into issues you can resolve this by clearing cache unable to log into teams on the desktop application teams missing or different information when compared to the web right it's not updating it can resolve it unable to find user in teams if you are looking for user in teams and it's not searching especially if you can search on the web but you cannot search on the application you can just clear teams cache and it will resolve it for you then general microsoft teams slowness of course you can decide to clear teams cache and it will be all good then profile picture missing or showing outdated image right the one on the web is different from the one on the app when you clear teams cache it can resolve it then team status not updating also clearing teams cache can resolve it but if teams cache clearing does not resolve an issue for you uh what you can do um of course you can see that the run for example if you come back to run and then you see these folders that you open again everything is back right these are now fresh ones for you now but if the issue does not still go away like you still have loopings going on here and you cannot resolve the issue so what you can do is to run teams in what is called compatibility mode what can you do you also come here you right click on teams you quit teams and teams is now all gone in a bit so get out teams i expect it to close very soon so while that is doing that uh what we do is we now search for yeah teams has closed already so we now search for teams at this time you do not click on it you right click on it you open in file location right and when you get to the file location you right click on it again you go to properties right okay so when that opens for you you see what is called compatibility then most of the time this is not checked by default so you check this box you click on apply you click on ok and you restart your pc most of the time this is going to resolve the issue that clearing microsoft teams catch could not solve so how do you handle issues regarding teams app not launching properly unable to log into teams teams meeting different um, information when compared to the web version unable to find user in teams and all of these if you try to clear team scratch and it does not work for you try to run teams on compatibility mode this is how to clear teams on windows i just showed you but if you're on a mac os this is how to you can follow through this step to see how you could clear team scratch on os so um that is all i want to show you today regarding clarity team scratch I want to put up some other videos on uh, troubleshooting Microsoft Teams issue. Just make sure you stay tuned and you try to follow through. I hope you're going to enjoy this. If you have any issues regarding this um, particular video, of course, you can reach out to me 
as usual we'll be able to discuss on how you can get these basic issues resolved thank you and i hope you have a wonderful day bye